Jenna, thanks. Developing news when it comes to tracking viruses spread by mosquitoes. The State Department of Public Health has announced the first positive tests for Triple E today. This comes as Labor Day weekend and seasonal fairs are bringing people outside. Western Mass News reporter Maria Wilson joins us live after getting answers on what we should know. Maria? Chris, Abby, while this announcement is coming as fair season is already underway here in Western Mass, I spoke with one local expert who tells me you don't have to miss out on great activities like here at the three, fair, or three county fair in Northampton. The Massachusetts Department of Health announcing Triple E has been detected here in the Bay State for the first time this year. In fact, the Bay State has not had any Triple E cases since 2020. The potentially dangerous virus was found in samples collected in Worcester County on Wednesday. No human or animal cases have been confirmed so far. Triple E is a rare but serious disease that can be deadly. But Professor of Microbiology at the University of Massachusetts Amherst, Stephen Rich, says we should be cautious but not worried. People should just be aware of the fact that this is out there and it's something that's, it doesn't happen every year, but it happens every couple of years and it's always good for us to be warned about it. And it's a good thing that the state's letting us know, but um, don't let it um, curtail all of the activities that we might otherwise go about doing. And Rich tells me that the best way to avoid mosquito-borne illness is to avoid mosquito bites. And the best way to do that is to wear deep bug spray and to wear protective clothing. Live in Northampton, Maria Wilson, Western Mass News.